welcome back to another Bad Drivers Horizon, Freddy Boy 1212 Horizon. Why did I just say Horizon? Hey guys, welcome back to another Bad Drivers Horizon, Freddy Boy 1212 Hess Truck Review. Today, we are going to be reviewing the 1996 metal truck. It is the 1996 Hess Emergency Truck. As you can see, it says in the top of the box. Box is rather small, but so is the truck. And I'm not saying it's a small... I'm not say, I was going to say, I'm not saying it's a small truck, but I kind of just did. So, um... Yeah, I just... It just doesn't... It's not very long. And it's not very tall. It's not really anything. I don't know, it doesn't seem small to me, but it doesn't seem large to me either. The box seems small compared to other trucks. I feel like I feel like that whole thing that I just did there was kind of a blabbing hypocrisy, if that's a word. Um Yeah, so ignore that. Um that we have the box here and we have the normal standard picture of the truck on the side. Um, I like that part right there where you can see the uh, light shines nicely there. It shines up into the Christmas night, and there's the Christmas trees right there. So that is cool. Um, I'm just going to get the camera situated on that. And see, there's the truck pulling up to the Hess gas station, which used to exist. That's why all the boxes that you see, well, ever since, in, since 2014, which happened to actually be the last truck I reviewed, that was the last one with the gas station on the box. All the new ones just have the truck on this side. Um, so yeah, that is unfortunate. But I do like the Hess gas station. I mean, it's very nicely how they decorated it, and you gotta love it. So, that's that for that side. Um, yeah. There is, in fact, um, a huge chance that you are going to choke on this box, right? You can see right there, it says, Choking hazard, small parts. Um, not for children under three years of age. So I think that's just so Hess does not get sued by you because your small child goes up to a Hess truck box and is like, Mommy, I want to eat the Hess truck. And then they just start choking on the Hess truck and then their mommy sues Hess. So I, I, think that's, I think that's the deal with those and I believe that was on the 14 as well. I just didn't point it out. So um, as you can see normally... The uh, front of the box is the front of the truck. The other side um, is the same as the other, same as the side parallel to it, on the other, because it's the same image. Then the rear of the box is the rear of the truck, and they have the made in China copyright 1986 Emerald Hess Corporation, Woodbridge, New Jersey. So that's just some info. Um, so yeah, that proves that Hess is New Jersey. Um, you can see the top of the box where it gives you the info. Hess emergency truck, it says. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm, I apologize for that. Um, emergency siren, horn, back up alert, search light, real head and tail lights, uh, pulsating lights, uh, emergency flashers, and two energizer batteries. I wouldn't have wanted those batteries in any way because it's from 1996. <laughs> so I'm glad that this truck did not come with batteries. Um, I did get, well, I didn't, but my dad did get this one on eBay for me, if you're wondering where I got it. Uh, on the bottom of the box, which I forgot to show in the last video, is just some information like battery installation. And it tells you how to, like, pull the switch, like, really. Who are they expecting? Are they expecting, like, a baby? Or maybe that same, uh, three-year-old who choked on the box to, to not know how to use a switch, like, what? Like, that seems like the only person, and they probably wouldn't have one of these that would, like, not know how to use the switch like you use it. <laughs> okay, so that is the box for you. Um, now I'm gonna bring out our ba -ba -da -ba truck. And it looks like it has a flat tire, so I'll be repairing that. Um, I'll make some small talk a while. This truck is, um... I used to do this thing when I was little with my Hess trucks. It was like a Hess fire department or something. This wheel does not like being on correctly. Okay. You know what? I think that's good enough. Oh, it's not in the back right either. 
at least the wheel oh uh, there we go okay the wheel and whew, that wasn't anything actually that was just the light spinning around quickly the axle thankfully isn't messed up that's good news so here is a truck um if you're wondering I mean, you're probably not wondering too much on what it looked like because you just saw it on the box. I mean, how much, how much more of a glimpse could you get? So, um, here it is. I apologize if that light is bothering you. The light, this light, can't talk. Um, flickers sometimes, and it's doing that right now. Of course, it has to do that right while I'm doing my truck review, right? Um. So it has a ladder that extends up pretty tall. I, I'm gonna, I'll show you the full extent of it in a minute. So it goes all the way down there to the truck. It's actually a small ladder for a Hess truck. Well, for a Hess truck of its age anyway. Because I'll tell you what, the, the 1989 and 86 model truck has the biggest ladder I have seen before so that it's not a huge ladder but it's not necessarily a ladder truck well it is a ladder truck but I don't think that is his main purpose for using it I think ladder truck you might use it for but it, it, you know what I mean it just doesn't seem like you'd be like well I'm gonna use this truck for a ladder truck you'd probably use a, a better truck I'm not saying this is a bad truck either I'm simply saying this probably doesn't specialize in ladders. So here are the lights on this. Um, yeah. So, gee, sorry about that. I'm just trying to get it. So it does have pretty nice lights. Uh, they have the search light in the back, as you can see. Right there. And, um, yes, yeah, so they do have that. Um... I would get the lights for you, but I'm not sure if I'm going to or not. Uh, I, I always wonder why the light's there. It's like right under the, uh, it's like right on under the ladder. It's strange. So, um, yeah, I don't know why that's there. But, um, they have the search light, and then we have our rear Hess, and our standard Hess 1996 license plate, you can see. Um... So that's about it for lights, but we do have some more commands for the lights, like flashers. So that does flash like that. For some reason, the rear tail lights aren't on the pattern, they look. They just... I don't know why. They have some issues, obviously. Like, they don't go on the pattern as everything else. Um, a little odd, but we do go. Um, yeah, you can just, just turn the search light on. Because only my other lights are on all. And that's pretty much it for lights. Um, there are some sound effects, but the problem with it is there's no buttons on it, so it's just a switch. And that means if you leave it there, it'll be on forever. There's the horns. I like that horn sound. It's got kind of got that classic horn sound. I don't know if any of you guys have the 1990 truck, but it has kind of horn like that. And the 94 has a similar one. There's no sounds. Um, here's the siren. Rather loud. The cool thing about the sirens is it turns on the the lights like it would actually when you're when you're responding to a call. And since this is a four switch here, uh, problem with it is if you blast is the backup lights, which flashes the reverse lights. Her, I'm gonna show you my problem. The problem is when you try and switch that from reverse to off, you have to go through the siren switch. Like, like you you can't just go from that to off. You have to go. Oh, dude, that was a fail. Like it's still gonna second of the sirens. So I'm not saying that's a problem because it's just a toy. But if that happened in real life, which there wouldn't be a switch on it, but I'm just saying, if that were in real life. You'd scare someone because you're backing up and then you get out of reverse and with your backup lights and your sirens quick will flash and then everyone will be moving out of the way for you. Even though you don't got an emergency other than you're trying to get out of reverse. So, um Yeah, I don't think there's anything else. Well there's a lot well there's a lot of chrome on here. I'll just show you some of that. There's like this. I think it's like the engine, I'm not quite sure. I'm pretty sure the engine is back here on this truck. And that and that. 
and the wheel well, not really wheel well, but like over the wheels. Ladder, useless bit of chrome, I don't know what that's for, just for fun. Um, some storage, chrome down front, some more storage, um, symmetrical to the other side, and a chromed out back bumper. So yeah, that was our review of the 1996 Hess toy truck. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace out, and have a great day.